Dr. Barry Evan here with Blue Dog RV with the 377 MBS Solitude you're interested in. So uh, take a peek. So for starters, you've got all these beautiful graphics on the sides. Those have a five-year warranty on them. You've got a nice big drop-down chassis with huge under storage that is have a furnace output right to it. Uh, that's your central vacuum system there in the bottom. You've got uh, lights, plug-ins, as well as battery disconnect over here. Here's all your goodies as far as tank fill, water fear, purification, and outside shower uh, behind one and a half inch thick you know, slam latch doors with magnets. Super easy. You've got your one touch auto leveling system as well as one propane tank over here. You've got the Rotoflex pin box. It uh, reduces some of the chucking. Lots of storage up in the front as well. Another big propane tank over here. Here's the other side of the pass-through storage. There's your central vacuum system, some plug-ins, a nice light. And again, that is a heated underbelly and it's huge. And this guy, you've got a uh, spray port for uh, another spot for your outside shower. Solid steps, these are awesome. Screen door. Nice grab handle, you come in, big mirror, don't worry about that price, uh, what I quoted you earlier is where we're at. And uh, here, so you walk right into this mid bunk room, you get a nice couch that pulls out into a bed with a bunk on top of it that does just lift right up and out of the way. You get a nice little cabinet over here for some nice hanging clothes, full extension drawers, and a little spot for desk, computer, TV, whatever have you. It's coming in over here, you got all your dials here, and it does have the tank heaters on fresh gray and black, gas electric water pump, all the lights, all the slides, all the goodies, that shows you how full everything is, all your light switches. You come in here, nice big island with the oversized stainless steel 6040 sink, as well as the gas and electric 18 cubic foot refrigerator, this thing's big. And fantastic, there's no space here, you can actually hold full-size pizzas. Not only that, but you have a full-sized oven that you can actually cook a pizza in. Not to mention, it cast iron tops are all spark ignition now, no longer have to pilot light. As well as little dog dishes. And over here under the sink you get gobs more storage, lots of pull-outs. You also have counter space over here with a nice backsplash. More counters and cupboards, gobs of storage there. And then you have an actual size pantry with pull out drawers as well. Great use of space in here. Nice full size convection microwave. And over here, you also get your nice big screen TV with a fireplace. I believe that's 5000 BTU output. And out in here, you get all your controls for your CD, DVD player. It can play music inside, it can play music outside, it can do one or the other or both. And the back here is your nice big pull out couch that'll make into a large size bed if you so wish. On both sides, it's got plug ins and uh, USB plug ins. And you've got nice actual roller shade drawer, or roller shades, those are great. Pretty valences, you get gobs of storage on top of that as well. And then directly across from the TV of your Thomas Paine recliners with these little stands that pop right out. These are uh, massage, recline, and heated seats. More roller shades, you get your four, uh, four chair dinette. It does have a flip up as well if you need a little extra space out of it. Uh, the chairs are in uh, transportation mode right now. But, Moving on into the front, you will see this is the central vacuum system that pushes it down into that underpass storage. You do get some storage under there for like a shoe kick or whatever have you. As well as, here's the nice loft for the bunk above the bunk room. Get some plug-ins, some storage, they get their own little, uh, little vent there, nice window. And coming into this guy, into the bathroom, Solid surface counter still with stainless steel faucet, an actual medicine cabinet, glass shower doors, nice big spacious shower. I'm 6'4", and 
I got plenty of headroom, especially with this giant headlight. Actual stainless steel fixtures there. Porcelain toilet, that's easier to clean, less holds less microbes, as well as actual spot to hang your towels, it's huge. As well as some nice extra storage over there. Coming into the bedroom, this is the king size bed option with, this is kind of neat, you get a little sitter drawer there, opens up, plenty of storage in that guy, as well as gobs of storage under the bed. This spot's felt lined for, you know, either jewelry, guns, or whatever you want to put there. And then, so you get uh, nice light above the bed, as well as this huge closet up in the front with nice little tuck-ins for whatever halves you has, as well as a nice shelf up top, as well as lights. And then you get another dresser in here with plug-ins and washer-dryer hookup. Or if you just want to use it as more storage, all better. As well as one more dresser right here in front of the bed. With full extension glide drawers. TV up here. Fully ducted AC in this guy. As well as there's your heat controls. And you do have a second AC back here. Now they use a racetrack design AC system where it's circular, which uh, makes it more efficient and quieter. They also insulate their ducts, which is awesome. And then uh, you'll notice there's no floor vents anywhere in the floor. They're all cabinet fed so that they're able to use a single one piece flooring with no holes cut in it. So that, uh, that adds for your strength as well as longevity. And you don't have to get dust hair, dog debris, all that down in the registers that need to be cleaned. So, in uh, true Four Seasons, like I said, this one does have the tank heaters as well as uh, they've got, they force air from the furnace directly into the storage facility for the tanks. Now, you do have high rated tires. Grand Design, with any purchase of a new rig, has a uh, five year life on the tires, two year roadside, and one year no questions asked. You also get the Equiflex suspension, that's a dampening system, a rubber dampening system, that also helps reduce some of that chucking uh, when you're towing a big fifth wheel. Stormproof windows, you got the big awning on this guy, as well as the even bigger awning up front here. Those are fully powered. And coming around the back, we've got a ladder to get onto the top. You have a prep for a backup camera there. It takes all the uh, time and money out of having to install one. Just buy the camera, plug it in. Also has a bumper. It is rated for, I think, 300 pounds for worth of bikes. Or if you're somewhere where you're trying to tow, you can tow uh, up to 3,000 pounds behind it if you got enough truck. Uh, neat things, they use a mylar tape on all their jams. It's not that putty you see in other cheaper trailers. It has a much better life lifespan to it as well as all their lights are automotive grade as opposed to like uh, just a, a putty seal that most other trailers use much easier to fix if you do have a broken one and uh, here's the back side you get some your slides with all your windows and back to where we started hot water heater and your furnace output right there hope this is helpful and any questions you have feel free to call